Hello guys, this is Pegasus Audits. Uh, I'm in the Silly Isles. Um, I'll have to turn around the side, it's easier for me uh, angle. Right guys, this is, as you can see, um, this is the Isle of Silly, uh, just off Penzance, about three, uh, two, uh, two hour, 45 minute boat ride from Penzance Harbour, going to uh, the Isles of Silly. Now, Guy uh, mentioned it. Um, respect to him, I can't remember his name now. Um, but yeah, the uh, he recommended Isla Silif to me, um, which is brilliant, in fact. Um, respect to him, he knows who he is. He was waiting for my video. Um, but we're up near Prince Charles's house. This is the archway. This is where Princess uh, Charles brought Princess Diana and the Prince uh, Harry and William and Prince Diana. Princess Diana. That's where they used to live. This is a guard house. Nice small houses. This is a uh, gatehouse. Which is, that's the archway with the bell. And this is where Princess Diana stayed up there, which is up that walkway. Right, there's a, it's a detention cell. I don't know who they put in here, probably, um, God knows, someone who obviously broke in the walls. Or, you know, tried to break in. It's very echoey, you can't really see. You can see the sort of size of it, guys. Look at it. It's mad. It's only got a little padlock. Don't know what that is. Powder magazine. And the detention cell. Look at it. All right. It's a nice little place around here, guys. Um, so this is Gar Garrison House. I'm sure, I don't know what this is. Safe catering. Self catering. Visit England. Right, guys. Um, I'll walk up this driveway. There's a house up the top here. But I'm not too sure if that was Prince Charles's house. He doesn't live up here now. He, uh, he used to stay in a holiday cottage um, over the other side of uh, Silly Isles. Um, but since, obviously, Prince Charles and Diana, um, obviously Diana died and everything changed. Um, he hasn't been here since, I believe. That's what a couple of the locals said, he ain't been here for years. Um, not surprising now, William and Harry are, are grown up now. Harry's in the papers every day, acting like an idiot, and uh, that's down to him, isn't it? But I did like Harry a lot better than William. He's more my cup of tea, because obviously Harry's a, a party lad, which is good. But now he's a pain in the arse. Look at that for you guys. There's me ferry down there. Lovely. Yeah, this is called the Star Castle Hotel now. our British flag guys. Still loads of foreigners in this country though. Thank you. 
Right, let's have a look in here, guys. Look at Golden Family Crest. Goldafin Family Crest, sorry, guys. So you guys can have a look and pause when you need to. Hotel entrance and dungeon bar. Hotel entrance and dungeon bar, eh? That's right. <laughs> that sounded like a pig. <laughs> right, we're up the top now. This is strange, isn't it? This is a, looks like where they used to have the cannons or the shooting fire from the side through the holes. Oh, look at that, guys. Look at that view. <laughs> there's, there's the sea. Should have done that. I'll probably be thrown off the island now, guys. Good old Pegasus. Yeah, see the harbour down there, guys? Silly Isles. Isles of Silly. Across Cornwall. Lovely. Absolutely stunning. Beautiful. In case you all get seasick or something. Oh. <laughs> right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Strange place, guys, isn't it? It's got lovely views though, around everywhere. There's not really a lot to do on the island. There's a handful of shops. Um, I was told that it's beautiful. It is beautiful. It's nice, but it could be better. Do you know what I mean? Um, for a two-hour and forty-five-minute cruise over from over from Penzance to Isles of Scilly. That's probably why they call it the silly. I don't know. Um, right, guys. Probably take off. Well, probably about an hour to walk around the whole island. It's not a big island. St Mary's, where we're at, um, is the biggest island on the uh, Isles of Scilly. But there are uh, three other islands to uh, see. You can hire electric uh, buggies or you can hire mountain bikes like we've done. Very cheap, nine pound a day. Oh, four hours, nine pound for four hours for a mountain bike each. So I think that's pretty good. If it was in London, it'd probably be about 50 quid. Mind you, the hire bikes are cheap. Boris bikes. I'll show you the colour of me uh, of the bikes we hired. You wouldn't need lights in the dark, that's for sure. You must have picked uh, two bright bikes. Morning. He was nice, wasn't he? Women are always bad, tempered. No, not you. But the women in Cornwall, yeah. in, in particular, are quite rude. Oh, your sausage meat. Yeah, bloody sausage meat. So a lot of sausage meat in Penzance. <laughs> <laughs> Corrupt. Corrupt as they come. 
I respect everybody. Um, if you if you don't mind, guys, if you like, share, and subscribe to my channel, um, it's taking quite a long time for me to get to a thousand. Uh, I'm only doing these audits because obviously, uh, you know, it's quite calming and it don't give you a headache. There's our bikes, guys. Uh, I don't need lights, see? Cars will be able to see you. See, there's two. But yeah, the seats give you, uh, the seats give you piles. But I'll give you, I'll, I'll show you another detention cell again. Because I'm really amazed by that. Look, you can hear your echo. See? God, do you imagine being in there? I couldn't be in there. Is that in case you but like break into Charles's house? Probably. Um, yeah, so guys, I'm not too sure because I'm not. That's a hotel and a pub up there. There's a tension cell there. You got the uh, powder magazine there. God knows what that means. Probably just uh, they build the magazines for the guns, I'd imagine. Or it could be a magazine you read. Um, but there's a few houses, a few houses about, there's nice gardens. Um, but I can't really, I can't really uh, sort of go, wow, you know? Um, some people, it's for some people, mainly older people, I think, because this is like a retirement village. Um, and the ferry's a bit boring, to be fair, guys. If you, if you, uh, you can't smoke on board now, but I, we do. Uh, we just go off the side and have a fag off the side. Why not? Um, got a lot of Karens on there as well, mask wearers and stuff. People are so scared around here for COVID, you know. I'll tell you a story in a minute. Talking to a lady, um, a lady in uh, St Ives yesterday, and she was scared out of her, out of her mind. Uh, she was in her 60s. She was a shop owner for gifts. And uh, a couple of shops next door to her closed down because apparently they had COVID, which obviously I tried to tell her that it wouldn't be. Um, and they, they said they've got a thousand cases in Penzance. Now, when I looked, um, well, St. Ives, sorry, and Penzance, so Cornwall have got about a thousand cases. But when I looked on the data, it was a flat line. So I don't know, people are starting to, trying to scare people. Um, it's not very good. Boris was over in uh, St. Ives. Um, on Saturday over the weekend and last week talking their crap no no doubt um, nothing will get done as we know um, but I'm not going to talk politics because I'll, I'll probably end up throwing my phone down the uh, driveway right guys let's get on to the tourism <laughs> um, that's a nice cottage isn't it yeah that's... Right, I'll just show you around here a bit, guys, because uh, it's getting on a bit and it's uh, the rain. It's a bit fine rain. But again, there's the guard house. Um, yeah, right, okay, we'll go back up here. I've just done a salute to the guard house. Thought I'd give it a go. Gave myself headache when I did that. But... Right, guys, I know I'm gibbering on a bit, but um, I'm just trying to take you around. I don't know much of the history around here. Uh, all I know that it's, uh, it's for old people. Um, yeah, not, not really for young people on this island. Um, but yeah, please guys, subscribe, share and like. Uh, and another thing, the uh, Live Free has also um, told me um, well, not live free, sorry. Um, a guy, I don't know if it was a a bit of a troll or not, I don't know. Um, but he kept saying, oh, live free, he's dumped me and all that. I haven't got, uh, you know, I, I don't have a car anymore because he's dumped me. He's a bit of a, I think he's a bit of a spastic. But, um, but I told live free and live free uh, said, no, I haven't dumped you, mate. Um, and all that, and plus I've got a car, so it doesn't really bother me, but... But anyway, me and Live Free still talk to each other. Um, he's, the only problem with Live Free, we do different things. Uh, Live Free does 
like a lot of um, shouting and I don't. Uh, but I love a lot of, well I did like, well I used to love uh, Liv Free's uh, work. But obviously when he's with Marty Blagborough and uh, Chunky Monkey and all that kind of stuff, um, it just doesn't look good. Uh, I'm not that I'm not that sort of guy. I'll do prisons. I'll do police stations, which I've got ten prisons to do when I get home, um, which is all over the UK. Well, England, sorry first, and then I'm going up to Scotland and then over to Ireland um, throughout the summer. So keep an eye out. Um, they should be good. But like I said, I, me and my partner come away for a break for a week in Cornwall. Um, we will go home Saturday, so it'll be a week and. Uh, yeah, I mean it's a good holiday in Penzance. Don't get me wrong, but if you don't like, um, if you, well, if you like using your phone, I wouldn't bother because you you don't get a lot of uh, signal on this island, on the Isle of Scilly or Penzance. If you go to Nuka, you can get full signal, which is a bit weird. I just can't wait to get home to go uh, to, uh, for 5G. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna head off. Um, but I hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, it's a bit of a baffling one because I'm I've only been told a few little snippets on uh, on this island. But if anyone wants to come over and have a look, uh, by all means, it's not for everyone. Um, yeah, that's all I can say really. Um, respect, guys. Please share, like, and subscribe. Um, get me up to a thousand uh, subs so I can do my live. Um, mental health and addiction sort of uh, videos, which I want to do, um, phone-ins and all that kind of stuff. So I need a thousand subs for that. Um, and I'll give you a lot of content. Cheers, guys.